I heard about the dance through my friend Bob Gapsch. He was my neighbor at the time and he had three daughters. And what he did was because he couldn't afford to take um, all three daughters every year, he rotated each daughter every other year. So it was, you know, he would take one daughter and then the next year another daughter and then the third daughter the next year after that. And um, he was just really spoke well about the dance and um, he asked me if I would go and I said, yeah, sure. So I ended up starting that back when Ava was first born. Back in 2008 was my first dance. I brought her in a little car seat carrier. <laughs> yeah, and spoon fed her at the table and carried her out there on the dance floor and we danced and had a great time. December 7th of uh, 2011, I was diagnosed with cancer, uh, very aggressive cancer tumor in my right thigh. And I was told I was gonna go through uh, radiation for a couple months. And then I was gonna have surgery to remove the tumor after radiation on March 1st of this year, 2012. And uh, the doctor told me that um, I'd be having surgery on March 1st and he wouldn't know uh, until he actually went in to take the tumor out what the extensive um, damage would be to my leg. I just told him, I said, uh, whatever happens, in this surgery, I said, I have a father-daughter dance on March 16th. I don't care if I'm in a wheelchair, but I'm gonna be there. And I said, can you make that happen for me? And he goes, we'll see what we can do. <laughs> That's awesome. But, um, you know, I made it to the dance uh, literally two weeks after surgery. I was on crutches and uh, I didn't want to let my daughters down. Um, they were very excited about the dance and, uh, and we had a great time. I wasn't able to get down and boogie too much, but um, they had a great time and that's what was really important. What it means to me um, to be a dad um, to both my biological daughter and my stepdaughters is, is just such a blessing to me. They change my life. They make me a better person. Um, they bring out qualities in me that um, I never would have had if I had not been a father. And um, I learned so much from them and hopefully they learn a lot from me. And um, it's just such a great blessing to be in their lives. And I feel, I feel uh, very blessed every day. And I'm very thankful to have them in my life. And, um, I want this to be a tradition in their lives too, the father-daughter dance and for many years to come. It's kind of like a really important date. It's kind of like a father-daughter prom date and it's where everybody gets dressed up and has a great time and you have dinner and you're actually spending that whole evening with them and only them and just really making it special for them. And um, the way Tammy does the dances with, uh, you know, having, you know, a piece of jewelry or something to put around their neck during the evening and, and uh, you know, tell them that you love them and, and just really sharing a special moment in life with them is just beyond words. I mean, you can't, you know, normally in life, uh, we get so busy and we don't do things like that. And this really is an opportunity to um, have that special time with your daughter and um, continue that for years. You know, you know, make a tradition and make it very important in their life and, and in yours too.